Hello there. I'd like to share a very beautiful experience that I had with a client just recently. He was very interested about, of course, knowing about uh, past lives and how that interconnected with people and this very fascinating concept that the, the important people that you meet is no coincidence. Everyone comes into your life for a reason. And I thought, okay, let's do that with him and I. And so I have this, you know, lovely little intuitive technique where I look at that person in the eyes and just looking into their eyes just sort of like reveals on a deeper level psychically the vision of what I'm trying to pick, pick up on psychically. And so I went in to find out the past lives that we shared. And there was one past life that we did share where uh, it was a very sweet past life where I got the sense that I was a teacher, I was a music teacher, and he was my student, I think like a violin student, which I thought was very sweet. But then I went into it more and there I felt a, a karmic disharmony that occurred in that lifetime between us. And the gist of it was, is that after I think the sessions ended, something happened to him in that lifetime, something negative, which I did not allow myself to follow up on. And it just sort of like revealed itself to me that my soul was calling to him in that lifetime to continue helping him. And I didn't listen to it. I ignored it or I got distracted. And sometimes that happens. And so what I felt is that in this lifetime to balance and bring harmony, ignoring that message soul was giving me that he was brought back into this lifetime so I could finally help him where I could not in that lifetime. And that, and I sense that, it was it, it really had a lovely, uh, profound effect on me because it showed me how the divine and one's soul does not waste any moment in the interaction between soul and, and another person's soul. My soul said, help him, and I ignored it. And it remembered. And so in this lifetime, that karmic balance is now coming back into balance and bringing itself into harmony. And that is a beautiful message that it doesn't matter whether it is big or small. If you feel your soul calling you to do something, if you feel your soul calling you to help someone, to bring service to someone, then you answer it because each time, each time you listen to your soul and you do it, that brings you closer to your light, that helps you to embody your light more. No action is ever wasted. No action in the soul's infinite memory is ever wasted. It all comes back into harmony from disharmony. It all comes back in our natural evolution. Our minds may perceive it as small or insignificant, but never to the universe. Each small action we do, each place of kindness or service that our heart and our soul calls us to do in sincerity is all bringing us back into the light. And that was a very beautiful reminder.